Well, hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Hairbrain Games. Today we're going to do an unboxing of a game that arrived at the shores of my house, aka my porch. This is Voidfall from Nigel Buckle and David Schertze. Artwork by Ian O'Toole. I could not be happier with those three names. I know all of them from various games of popularity. In fact, I have really enjoyed Nigel's game of uh, uh, Imperium Classics, Imperium Legends. This, because the Galactic Box, I didn't remember when I backed it that I backed it at its fullest and most supreme uh, representation. And so without further ado, let's get into the box, because I don't exactly remember what this game is about. I know it's space exploration, 4X Euro game-ish kind of thing, but let's all find out together. Ooh, the Voidfall Companion app. Ooh, makes the gaming session smoother. Yeah, I want that. All right, and then we have these big Hurkin. One, two, three, four, five sheets. Oh, planets. Planets. All right, that's big. I like the art. It's Ian O'Toole. Of course I'm going to like the art. And then we have the Voidborn Fleets. These are icon reference sheet and there's a lot that I can look at here <laughs> icon look at here anyway uh, installations man I haven't seen this many icons since revive ooh the terminal tray manual galactic box tray manual shows me how to hold all of the pieces and there are a lot of pieces in this game holy smokes wait a minute so we've got the galactic tray or manual so we have a manual for the tray, and we have an overview for the tray to show you how everything fits. Boy, tray. All right. And then we have the rule book. Start here. Kind of makes sense. Whoa. I have got my nightly reading cut out for me. 40 pages of glorious goodness. And it lists, thank you, how to use the booklets, how to play. Man, this is... There's a lot going on here, and I mean a lot going on here. This looks like something I could dive into and play for the rest of the year at this point. Anyway, there's the rule book. We have the glossary, because it's not enough to simply know the rules. You must know them in glossy, glossy glory. Look at that. Holy smokes. Looks like each and everything is given very detailed information. Lots of breakdowns, lots of abilities, lots of powers, lots of galactic event cards. Everything is covered here. I mean, I can't tell you, like, the manuals alone are impressing the snot out of me. Compendium, used together with the rule book. That's right, because there's like 58 scenarios and like tons of asymmetric factions. Welcome to a grim galaxy. A menace from beyond. I'm not going to give away a lot of this because it looks like, whoa. Game setup, how you play, house setup, look at that. Tutorial, thank you. All right. On book seven, that I <laughs> there's a tutorial. Scenarios, aggression, levels of aggression. There's a lot. Just the manuals themselves are just in ooh, Devil's Triangle. When darkness fades, kingdom come. <laughs> These names are so heavy metal band. All right. And then we have... Uh, looks like some fanciful trays here. Tray one, tray two. Ooh, look at all these ships. Let's take a look at the ships inside here and see what plastic hath wrought. Ooh. This reminds me a lot of Defensive Procyon, which is another game which had some crazy cool tons of nice plastic miniatures. This looks even more, even more detailed. Here, got those. You've got these. Looks like there'll be ways to connect them up there. Nice. So you got those. And then you've got what looks like a tremendous amount of these for holding various components, which I think will hopefully expedite the game. You've got this tray, which has alien gloopies of some sort. Alien rock stars have gloopies. All right. And then we got this. We have... Oh, these are rubbery. Very rubbery. Oh, nice. And we've got these stands. This is all going to come together and make sense somehow, some way, shortly. And then... We have... These. These here. 
Hmm. This must be for some sort of during game thing that's going on. Huh. And then we have... I hope I remember how to put all this back. Okay, more trays. More, more trays. And then we have even more trays. And this has smaller little... Ooh, look at these little tiny ships. These are so cute. These are like... I'm impressed with like the, it's almost like the rubbery consistency in the regular plastic. And then we've got these ships, and more ships, and dial ships. Oh my gosh. I'm just going to be swimming here. And then we've got more Voidfall trays. What are, in, what are in these trays? These are, these look metal. These look like actual metal. They are. They're metal coins, metal, metal health. Ah, it'll drive me mad. All right, and then we've got that, so that's done. And then, what else do we have? We have this white sheet of paper. And then we, oh, this must be the board. Oh no, these are the trays. Oh my gosh, double-sided again, or double-layered. You can see that, these are nice and thick. I don't see any of these bowing. Uh, and that's, that's good. So we've got these trays that we're gonna be mindful of. And more trays, how many trays? Oh, this is a game tray. That. Again, wide, interesting, and, and then more trays of, ooh, then we got these flexi, flexi, this must be special characters or asymmetric powers or factions or, oh yes, House Novaris, complexity four, what about this little clown guy, complexity three, yeah, I think I'll start with him when I play the game, and then we have more trays, oh my gosh. All right, we got, uh, who doesn't love the little square things? We got dice of different colors. Purple, can't go wrong with purple. We've got, we've got this special tray here, which seems to be necessary for, oh, that one must just stay in there. And then at the bottom, we've got all of the trays here with all of the pieces and all of the, oh, wow. These, now this is interesting, tiles that actually have detente in them. This is like almost triple layered. Because there's detente on this side and detente on that side, or like insets in that side. Which means that there's a lot going on here. And then we've got big tarot-sized cards for apparently production of some kind. And then we've got more little cards with price of greatness. These must be actions of some kind that does something. I'm sure I'm going to read all about it tonight on the bedside when I go through the 40-page manual at night. Trying to stay awake. Any of you guys run into that? And then there's that. And then finally we have these cards here. And that, my friends, is what comes in this bountifully large, large, large box of stuff that comes in Voidfall. I don't know about you, but I'm excited to someday be able to actually sit down and play a game because this is a massive game with many ornamental improvements, particularly in the galactic box. So, counter trays... For many days. Alright, thanks again, and we'll see you next time on Hairbrain Games. Mm -hmm.